Call it a huge tool in the fight against opioids like fentanyl. Deaths tied to that reached an all-time high in 2020. Now one central Texas group is arming local law enforcement with what they need to fight back. 25 News reporter Angela Parsky has a behind-the-scenes look. Todd, that's right. It's part of a new initiative at the McClendon County Sheriff's Office to get all deputies trained to deal with the mental health crisis. An overdose prevention group joined deputies today and brought along some life-saving tools. When someone overdoses, time is key. The quicker that the person overdosing is given Narcan, the more likely it is that they'll survive the overdose. Now there's an effort to get McLennan County law enforcement trained to save a life even before an ambulance arrives. So anything that we can do to, to help out the people who are on the front lines, uh, we're up for it. Richard Bradshaw with Central Texas Harm Reduction and Brazos Recovery Services brought deputies a box full of Narcan and a wealth of information on Wednesday. ABC administer breathe call. Every deputy carries the drug designed to reverse an overdose. We carry it in our medic bags. Wednesday's training made sure they know how to use it if the moment comes. We're a little more comfortable with the fact that we can come back and tell our guys, hey guys, if you have to open 10 packages until the ambulance gets there, um, do it. Bradshaw says medical care should come long before jail time. We're not anywhere close to a level that would be deemed as optimal but we're definitely making steps in the right direction. He hopes by working with law enforcement, he'll help remove the stigma of drug addiction. Brazos Recovery Services runs a 90-day addiction recovery program out of Bosque County. We'll have more information available about their resources on our website, kxxv.com. In downtown Waco, Andrew Lamparski, 25 News.